Yo sí me puedo. Ya. Let's do the Brisbane Lions game. Let's go. Brisbane is free over there. Jonathan Brown. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, this is a bit schmick. No, I'm around here, actually. Yeah, I just saw him then. To the Gabba in Brisbane. Uh, alongside me, former Blue, former Lion at Mitch Robinson. Robbo, oh. great to have you on this Saturday afternoon football. Great to be here, and yes, we are back. It's Neil Erasmus. The umpires uh, for the 12, John Howard. I reckon it's going to be a battle of the midfield. Look, but our forward line of Brisbane Lions, it's, it's, it's formidable. It's got a lot of options for goal, but the midfield obviously containing Sarong, Brasher and O'Meara, that's their best three players they're going to be going through there. Sarong's having a great year, averaging 32 touches a game, which is right up there with the best in the comp. And then we've got Aussie Lockie Neal, uh, Dunkley, Ashcroft, McCluggy, Jazorko, a lot of those blokes go through there. And, and I think it's one of those games that Lockie Neal gets up for because obviously playing against his old team and he's going to be very excited today. And he, after playing with him, I know this week means a lot to him playing against his old mob. Frederick, Frederick and a doctor injury for about three to four weeks then. Through there, Bannon. Oh, so free mantle. Young got tackled. Now they've got to apply pressure here. Clark's in trouble. Umpire said play on. Charlie picked it up though. Had a snap on a goal. Oh yes. Oh, they're Charlie. into it too. They're into it in there. Yeah, I spoke about it. The handball game early. I don't, I don't like it, but that last play they did wasn't too bad. They got through the middle and that, but then they tried, they tried to do it again and the forward line pressure from Charlie Cameron. Eric Hipwood was in there and then turn it over and then Charlie Cameron goal. But that's what I'm talking about. If you want to do the handball game, it's, it's, it's going to cost you sometimes and the Lions pressure looks like to be right on now. He's a spiritual leader down there at the Lions. The boys love him. The coaches love what he brings to the culture. So it's great to see him back in and, he's and get, getting an early touch. He's going to get an early touch here. Walsh is going to oh, fly. Oh, speak of caught, the devil. Beautifully caught, Mitch Robinson. Whoa. We picked that out a moment ago. I should uh, be professional. Ryan Lester. And look at over to Zorko and completely unmarked. And the boys are getting around Lester right now in the yes. background. Everything you want tonight, talk us through it. Mitch Robinson, our local expert. As you see here, Ashcroft on the fly. It's a boundary hit from Oscar. He's his... Hamble to oh, but oh my. He's kicked it with his right foot. A la out of the Charlie. Air. It's Ascot. 26 inside 50 to 9 at the moment. 45 out, 45 degree angle. You'll tell from the crowd's reaction. He's, he's got, got it. it. He's got two. He's got the only two goals in the quarter, Will Ashcroft. He's flying at the moment. What a, what a, what a kid. This is his breakout game, I reckon. It's coming Not back. Not a bad looking kick back. either, Eric. Yes, he's one step closer to 200 with that one. Yeah, no, that was a great play from Zorko. He had the ball on the boundary and he could have blazed away and gone top of goal square here, but he uh, he chose to spot up Eric Hitwood. Great little great little chip kick over to him. And he, he didn't look too confident at the start. He was looking for a pass off, but then... He must have heard Andrew Brown in the commentary box. He said, go back and kick it, son, and he put it through the middle, which is great for his confidence. Yeah, it is. And, and the pressure around the ground for Fremantle's obviously uh, a lot higher at the moment. I wouldn't know the, the number, but it's a massive um, KPI as he goes. Brings it back in. Joe Danaher. And what a mark. One back. on two. Then they'll make the Brisbane Lions go long down the line, which I think might be coming up. Ball ends with McCluggage. Underrated. Specky. Uh, oh! oh Tender there. <laughs> Who was that going up? Was that... Was it Dunkley? No. Lester? No, it was Dunkley. It was Dunkley. No, it was Dunkley. Was that Josh Dunkley? Was it was it? Josh Dunkley. Lester can't jump over a jam <laughs> team, so I was going to... I would have well, left, left the building. I just saw the side. five at the back as the player was askew from my view, and uh, the ball down, or tackle without the ball there was Brayshaw. I probably caught play on. And Walters, he's sunk to the ground by Harris Andrews. Oh! Son, son, Walters. So Harris, let's go. He stands up, three blokes around him. Oh, oh my goodness. Michael Walters, take a bow. Just finished commentating the game. Not a bad game. Brisbane Lions actually smashed Frio, but it's good fun nonetheless. Hopefully you enjoyed that vlog. Going home, I'm pretty tired. The chest is footy this morning and then this, so I'm done skis for the day. See you later. Just feeling it, just feeling it. Oh, i got to duck off. i got the kids at home. Great help. Are you starting off? Don't talk. All right, so I've got into project reform. Going to go a little tour with Cam Rayner. We're going to have a suss at the gym. And stay tuned because I've got a big prize for you guys at this gym with the Lions boys. Come with me. <laughs> Cam, it's Mitch. <laughs> <laughs> it's our teammate. Hey guys, how you going? Wow.
<laughs> so we're here at Project Reform. This is Cam Rayner, little shindig they got going on. I've heard big things about this. I wasn't invited to the launch, but I'll still come through. You were invited, you didn't. No, 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 I was busy. I've got three kids now and they don't reply to my text. That's, anyway, that's in the past. No, no, it's good. Well, it's good to finally get you here, mate. You know, you're more than welcome to come here whenever you want. So run me through why starting this and how it all come to fruition. Um, me, myself and Darcy Gardner, Dill, as you know, all involved, Reese. Um, you know, we, we thought there's an opportunity to have this gym here. Um, we can give you everything, really. You got 24-7. Yeah. Recovery, oh. functional classes, oh. Pilates, oh. <laughs> whatever you want, Rob, it's here. KO, binge, KO. <laughs> upstairs in the recovery booth. Netflix, <laughs> got Lions, Woody Boys here. <laughs> Who's this guy? There's some boys working here already. <laughs> <laughs> Go through, Rob. You can have a <laughs> Look at this guy, it's fine. Blob blobs, what's going on? <laughs> um, this is the first bit of the 24 7 gym, so you can come in and use this space whenever you want. More of the machines and stuff in here. Um, it's been a good job for all the boys to put it together. Yeah. I tried to put together one machine, and um, a lot of work went into it, but it's come up pretty good. Probably the best thing that you've got everything, like you know, so you can go in that side and do your big power lifts and all that kind of stuff, and you can come in here and still use your Smith machine. Machines. The and Matho's pretty much used every machine in here, and he's approved it. He's so. approved, it's got yeah. the Beast Motor Tick approval. Tick, tick, tick is my favourite gym in Brisbane, so get down here and use it. <laughs> Yeah. Are you coming in to shift in or are you coming in to film? Oh, I'll shift a little bit. Yeah. I'll buy some tries, obviously, nothing else. I don't do that shit anymore. So, you got all the stuff over there for shoulders, Everything. chest, um, testicles. We'll go, no one's using the gym at the moment, are they? The sauna? <laughs> nah, nah, just. I think so. We'll come have a look at the sauna. So, in here is the sauna. Horse! Oh, uh, we didn't know, this is space at the back we were not sure what to use, so put a sauna in here. Um, Pretty awesome, relaxing, um, and again, something that can have, you know. Good all, recovery. I will, all the same I things will in the one swear, spot. Yeah, I will swear by these things. Recovery, these things for recovery and for your muscles is elite. Yeah, they are really, really good. And after a long night out. Yeah, so you want to sweat out those <laughs> disgusting toxins and putting that stuff in your body? That's the place that's to the go. Place to be. So um, take us through to where the morning sessions and stuff yeah. are on Saturday. Functional classes roll through from the AM to the PM's Monday to Thursday. Ooh. Friday and then till Sunday, more the upbeat, you know, the weekend vibes, everyone comes out. Pretty sure there's actually a bit of a coffee club forming. There on is? Saturdays. Yeah, so after everyone does their functional class, they go to the coffee, but... Um, so run us through functional class. So you come in here, I've heard you have 35 or so 35, on the weekend. 35, yeah. So that's a class coming. We've got a couple of um, PT trainers to take it. Yeah. And, um, everyone can come in. That's a bit more of a, you know, if you're looking for something to come in, and you haven't been to the gym before. I feel that functional class is good it's just good getting in a group. If you don't have one, if you don't want to target things specifically, you come in here, you can work the whole body, right? Exactly right. And you don't want to come in and have to go up against a place like Matho and their private <laughs> gym. <so. laughs> it's a little bit intimidating, I'm not gonna lie. Come to a functional class is a great way to start. Everything. So on a functional day, um, this is obviously a bit more set up. You've got little stations around and you can yeah. work through, which is good. So now here you've got something that's pretty special upstairs, true or false. We do have something that's special upstairs. So get up there, boy. You also want to work in your glutes, this is for you. Osteo room in there, which is good, so you can book the in there, which is pretty cool. Yeah. You know, if you saw it at the start compared to what it looks like now. Oh, I heard this is to be a gun range. <laughs> yeah, it was, a, it was a gun store, so. And who we got behind here? So this is Jack, he's our osteo. Um, oh, our the, the body cracker. The body cracker, <laughs> yeah, if you need anything, sort it out. It's got a little basis, it's blow. Where the fuck did you get so smart? It's not me. Let's do it behind the camera. <laughs> <laughs> True, now so. this is what I this think nice that's area. very important to a gym and uh, like a recovery area. Double TV, bang, bang. Lazy boys, set your legs out. Um, the normal techs, which you know, we got these at the club. Yeah. Awesome So, use. all AFL players, if you want to be a professional athlete, I'm not just saying it because it's rain is like set up, but I have these at home myself. They are the best. And they're, it's like a flush, like you're getting a massage when you don't have a masseuse available. And I remember the first time I was working my first year, you said to me, you said, one rule um, if you want to have a long career is use the physios and use recovery. <laughs> See, I never get a pump up in the papers and shit when guys dominate. No, you did, you said that. This Just is the cream, de cream de la cream. It is. This is um, the Pilates room. <gasps> Um, I'll do a little effect for that. 15 beds in the one room, Rob. Yeah. So, got a couple of instructors that are really, really lovely. You know, Liv's, Liv, my partner's done classes up here. We had Harry Sharp coming this morning. Sharpie! Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> nah, but this is good to have, um, you know, another a form of exercise and a way to get recovery. And, you know, I feel like this is becoming really popular for people to use. Yeah, I do see Pilates, it's a bit on the socials that, So, this is such an awesome room to have. Such a big space. Yeah. Have all the beds in the one area as well. So, for people that want to book in for this kind of stuff, is a, a website, app? So, what, it's all on the go? app. All in our app. You download the project reform map, um, sign up, you can pick what you want to do and then off a calendar basis, yeah. see what times are available, see what dates are available, yeah. jump in, book in and, and go for it. Yeah. Well, thanks for coming through Rob and seeing the tour, lovely to have you. <laughs> and you've got some exciting news to finish. I do, thanks to the people at Project Reform, I'm doing an exclusive giveaway for two people. It can be you and your partner, you and your best friend, you can come down to Project Reform on 181 Wellington Road in East Brisbane yep. and it is a month free trial. So you usually get those stupid gyms doing, oh I'll do a week and then you're going to pay us X 
amount, but no, we're giving you a month access to all this. Make sure the best comment on this vlog will win a month membership for you and your friend. Perfect. Oh Get my down. lord, oh my lord. Thank you very Ooh, much. Ooh, <laughs> <the floor>. Yeah. <laughs> it's perfect, that would come up good.